Yes, please. Can we be can we be seated? Hello, welcome to this uh, very special uh, event, and uh, we are honored at the embassy to have our Papa here. Uh, before we proceed, I want to welcome the members of the sorry, introduce the members of the of the embassy. His Excellency Ambassador Debowale Adeshino is the head of mission. Beside him is Ambassador Stephen Ogidon, who is the deputy head of mission. Myself and Emmanuel Isaac Onogo, a first secretary. Here is Madame Mustafa Mala, our head of chancery. Then Madame Susan over there, a top secretary. You are all welcome. I will now yield the floor to Pastor, the leader from the Togolese uh, Church of Living of uh, Different Life to introduce his own delegation. We thank the Lord for this great opportunity to be discussing for on behalf of our nation, Nigeria, in this very embassy. We thank the Lord. First of all, I want to start by introducing our leader, the general superintendent, at the convener of GCP, Pastor Dr. W.L. Kukuli. It's just by your side. So. <laughs> by his side is our mother, the wife of our general superintendent, our mother, Mommy Esther Kukuli. Yeah. From my front here, first of all, we have here Pastor Ojumusu, who is the National Overseer and the coordinator, the general coordinator for this zone, Pastor Shana Ojumusu. Beside him is um, Pastor Edison Damilambo, he is the state overseer of uh, uh, Cross River State in Nigeria and the chairman of the planning committee of GCP. Let me sorry, um, I did something in their lives. Pastor James Napopole is the head of media GCK. Next is Pastor Stariki, he is a national overseer in Belgium. Next to him is Pastor Clovis, a national overseer of the Republic and that beside him is wife. Next to him is Pastor uh, National Overseer of Code of Beside him is the wife. Then uh, next to him is Pastor Ebenisa, the National Overseer of Togo here and that's Well, myself, I am Pastor Anya Sodor Christopher, uh, the National Overseer of Public of Madagascar. Uh, the uh, 
Okay, please, uh, I will allow the National Overseer of Togo to introduce some other uh, pastors that are here in Togo. Thank you. Uh, pastor of the Shabian, of the of the church of the Église en mission pour le salut. Église en mission pour le salut. We have Pastor Napoli. Napoli is the, the, the second the chairman of the Federation des Evangeliques du Togo. And uh, is part of that uh, Christian Association, Federation des Evangeliques Evangeliques. Togo. So he represents our chairman. Uh, we have Pastor Chabri, he is an apostle, Apostle Chabri from Eglise Le Bon Pâturage. Le bon pâturage. Uh, nous avons le Pasteur Adbeko, le Pasteur Adbeko de l'Eglise Baptiste Plein Évangile. Il y a aussi de l'église baptiste du plein de Thank you very much, uh, the National Pastor, for that introduction. And Pastor Annette Sedo. Thank you. I remember the name before. So I think at this moment, we will welcome His Excellency Ambassador Debole Additional to welcome his guest before hearing from his guest. Good, uh, I wish you the afternoon, good morning. Good morning, everybody. Papa, Mama, welcome. I'm sure that doesn't need a uh, translation. I said, Father, Mom, Dad, Mom, you're welcome. Togo. Uh, let me start by confessing my personal joy and my personal delight at receiving Papa and Mama here this morning. I was supposed to go back home to Nigeria for some official thing yesterday. And uh, when my brothers and our fathers came around to say Papa was coming, I then remembered uh, the prayers I used to receive from my grandfather and my two parents back home uh, in our village. After telling me or praying to God to bless me, make me succeed, get a good wife, get a good children, get everything as parents normally would do for children. After all of that, my parents would say, you understand that? Right? <laughs> may your life, may your destiny, or literally speaking, may your head not antagonize prayer, not reject prayer. So when I was told that Papa was coming, I made a promise to my uh, uncles and fathers who came around to say, on this particular trip, only you need to go. My guess is you don't get to So, whatever it would take, 
I will wait and receive my And as long as someone is here today, my prayer for all of us here, and for the people of Togo, for the people of Nigeria, and for the people of Africa, of Africa especially, may our destiny not antagonize his prayers. On the few occasions I've been at the church in Uganda, I saw Papa from afar, from the gallery. On the few occasions I've been Donc, at the headquarters, I've been there. Quelques occasions où je suis allé à Bagdada, et j'ai vu notre père de loin à Bagdada. So now that Papa was coming to my own bedroom, why would I leave him? So I decided I was it. Since I got here as ambassador of the Indian capital, a lot of new things and first have occurred under our tenure here. Donc depuis que je suis ici en tant qu'ambassadeur du Nigeria au Togo, de nouvelles choses et des choses uniques sont en train de se passer. And I believe Togo will be the first African country that GCK is coming to. Et donc je crois que le Togo fait partie des premiers francophones africains où GCK est en train d'arriver. I believe, I sincerely believe. Et je crois sincèrement que ma prière that this visit, on this visit, on this visit. The people of Africa will not remain the same. Because the future belongs to the young ones. I took my time to go through the brochure that was presented to me the last time you guys talked, the pastor visited. And I saw a lot of appeal to the youth, especially the future of Africa. Et donc, la dernière fois quand ils étaient là, ils m'avaient présenté des brochures quand les pasteurs étaient là. Et donc, j'ai pris du temps pour parcourir ces brochures. Et dans ces brochures, j'ai vu l'appel qui a été lancé à la jeunesse de l'Afrique. Uh, the intro, the pastor who was introducing, I was almost going to say, Papa does not need any introduction to me. Maybe it is me who you should introduce to him because he is our general in service of the Lord and we are following our soldiers. And as the Lord lived, his life shall continue to be a blessing to all of us and humanity. Once again, I have very little to say for now except to express my delight. You are welcome, you are welcome, and blessed by your presence. Amen. <laughs> I thank you very much, Your Excellency, uh, for that very edifying and encouraging uh, welcome. I appreciate that. At this moment, we wield the mic to uh, our Papa in the Lord to say a word or two. Your Excellency, the Ambassador, Your Excellency, the Ambassador, the Deputy, and all the members of staff. I'm so delighted that we're here for this occasion at this time. My coming to Togo, this is not the first time. I've been coming for a number of years. I attended the university to learn some French. And since that time, I've been in touch with Togo. We've had different kinds of meetings in Togo. Uh, when I think, uh, you are here, some of the time I was there. 
que le pasteur à Nassada était mon logo comme pasteur national. And our national pasteur hears not be interrupting today. For bringing the young people in Togo. We have had general meetings that have done wonderful things in our land in Togo. This time is special. We are here for a global crusade. And from Togo here, we'll be transmitting to many countries of the world. We'll be linking up with more than 150 countries of the world from Togo here at the Alpha location. This meant the theme of our crusade is abundant life through Christ. And our understanding of abundant life will be very, very limited. But what Christ meant and what Christ is going to do is what we call now abundant life through Christ. This crusade will touch the life of everyone within, without, around, external. It will do great and mighty things for every participant. Every kind of problem will be addressed. There will be healing, there will be deliverance, there will be many, many miracles. Lives that are shattered and scattered will be put together. We are pleading to you, everyone, to come. Government officials and our many Nigerians in the millions here in Togo are personally will be ambassador inviting you. We are going to have a breakthrough process. And so tell everyone around. We're starting tomorrow. That is the 16th of February 2023. Until the 21st of February, which is Tuesday. Just after over the man, conference that will touch everybody and bring a revival of the last days. Saturday is specially dedicated to the young adults and the teenagers. We're taking everyone to account up higher. Once again, the Excellency, I am grateful that you grant us this opportunity to have this for services. God bless everyone. God bless everyone. Thank you very much. I think at this moment, uh, we are all, or we have heard from our Papa, the special guest, he have said his purpose for being here. And it is believed that from here, we all will communicate his message to Et others. So at this moment, our duty, our remaining duty, is to please take a little refreshment that the embassy can offer. Thank you. Yes, yes. 